How to analyze yes-no data in SPSS. If you're working with survey data and have yes-no questions, analyzing this data in SPSS can be straightforward once you know the steps. Let's break it down. First, you need to enter your data into SPSS. When you create your variables, make sure to use descriptive names and labels. For yes-no questions, you typically use numeric codes, such as one for yes and to for no. In the variable view section, you can set the type as numeric and add a label to explain what the variable represents. Once your data is entered, you can start analyzing it. To see the distribution of yes and no answers, go to the Analyze menu, then select Descriptive Statistics, and finally choose Frequencies. This will give you a frequency table showing how many respondents answered yes or no to each question. You'll also see the percentages for each response, which can be very useful for understanding the data at a glance. For example, if you have a question like, have you heard of fake news stories? And you coded yes as one and no as two, the frequency table will show you how many respondents said yes and how many said no, along with the percentages. This helps you quickly see the overall trend in the responses. If you need to filter your data based on specific conditions, you can use the Select Cases option. For instance, if you want to analyze only the responses from people who answered yes to a previous question, you can go to Data, then Select Cases, and set the criteria accordingly. This will help you narrow down your analysis to a specific subset of your data. When interpreting your results, remember that yes-no questions are categorical variables. You can use the Variable Labels option to assign text labels to your numeric codes, making it easier to read and understand the output. For example, you can label one as Yes and two as No so that your output tables show these labels instead of just the numbers. By following these steps, you can effectively analyze Yes-No data in SPSS and gain valuable insights from your survey responses. Whether you're working with a small set of data or a large survey, these tools will help you extract meaningful information and present it clearly.